Hey everyone, this is Kareem the Dream, and um, today I'm just going to go over a moving mask. You may ask, uh, what the point is in a moving mask? Basically, the point is that you're not going to stop your video for however many seconds you want while you're changing the color or the tone of something. So, um, usually when people mask, they actually save a still image and mask it. I think it pers like personally, I think it looks terrible unless you do it properly. So to do this moving mask, um, I do it in a different way than most people. I do it without keyframes. So I take the scroll bar and I bring it all the way in until it's squeezed like that. So now I can go frame by frame and just keep clicking, split and splitting and splitting until I want the mask to stop basically so you'll see I'm not accomplishing much with this mask but you just want it to go frame by frame so that it's basically perfect if you don't want to be perfect you can make the scroll bar smaller but I like to make sure it's perfect so I'm on so when you do this move when you do this frame by frame you'll notice that your music tracks will fade and this causes a flickering noise to your uh, music track so what I do is I unfade each uh, music, music track it also happens for your song so just make sure you are aware of that so that it doesn't basically mess up your music so before I start this moving mask I'm gonna actually insert a video track right click insert a video track and I'm going to re I'm going to make this small again. I'm going to copy and paste each each one above. I'm only going to do it for the first one right now. And you just delete the audio track. And I'm going to go to video event pant slash crop for that top track. Remember, when you mask, you need two tracks. The above one is the one you mask so that the bottom one, so that you still have the background. So I go to video event pant slash crop. Enable mask and zoom in, and I just begin my mask. Um, as you can see, I did the mask pretty bad, but I'm not trying to be perfect right now. And most people won't try to be perfect because no one's going to see your frame by frame mask. As long as most of your masks are generally decent, it's still going to look good. Like, no, not everyone's a nerd like me and it's going to look at the frame by frame mask that you did. So I'm going to do both feather type, both in the properties bar and make the feather percent two, just so that I don't have that edging. And now whatever, usually for a moving mask, you'll add a color. So I'll just go to color balance red midtones just add it apply it to that track and now I'm just gonna make it the red I'm gonna make it 0.4 so then now you'll notice that my character is red for this whole frame and now I'm just gonna go to the next frame do the same thing I did before whoops just gonna do the same thing I did before I'm gonna copy it I'm gonna paste it delete track go to the beginning make sure you're always going to the very beginning of that clip and go to video event pan slash crop now go to mask and do the exact same thing you did before zoom in and remask I'm just going to make the feather percent both again and make the feather, I mean the feather type both and make the feather percent two. And this time I'm going to apply the exact same effect, red, and I'm going to make it four for the red, 0 0.4. Now you'll notice that when I go through these two frames, the video stays, or the character stays red. 
So this does take a lot of time, but in the end it looks good. Just don't abuse it. Don't do it throughout your whole video. Um, just do it maybe once in your video. It will look cool. People will be, well, they'll just like the way it looks. So, yeah, just enjoy this effect. And I didn't go through everything. I didn't do the whole mask because I don't have time for that right now. But you basically get the gist of it. Just make sure to unfade the music tracks because I've tried it. I have not done it once. Like there was a point, a time when I uploaded a video and I didn't unfade, and I noticed there was a lot of little flickering in the music. So just make sure you're unfading the little fades in the music. Um, thank you. Peace.